this tip, we'll see how to search and replace specific occurrence of a pattern with the set command. Consider this sample input string. Our goal is to replace only the third occurrence of colon character. If to do so, we can search for the colon character and we can just pass 3 as a flag. So this indicates that you want to replace only the third occurrence of the search pattern. Let us see one more example. Here we want to replace the second occurrence of a word that starts with T. So let us match a word starting with T. We will surround the matching term with double quotes. So by using two as a flag, only the second occurrence will be replaced. But what if you want to replace from the end of the line? You can use quantifiers and capture groups. Let us see some examples. Let's say we want to replace the last occurrence. So this is pretty simple. We can consume characters from the start of the line and then match a colon character. So because the longest match wins, this will consume all characters until the last colon. And in replacement, we can back reference this capture group and then provide our replacement string. So you can see only the last occurrence of the colon has been replaced with the string. Next, let us see how we can replace the last but one. We will have to modify the previous pattern. After this colon, we need to ensure there is at least one more colon character. In replacement, we need to add that capture group as well. So thus, we can replace the last but one occurrence of this particular search pattern. Based on this, we can construct a generic formula as well. So let's put this inside another capture group and apply a quantifier. So let's say the number two. So this will replace last but second occurrence. And this will work for the last occurrence as well. By specifying zero, the last occurrence will be replaced. So this is a generic formula. And finally, let us see how we can combine a number with the G flag. So here we are specifying a number as well as the G flag. So what this means is the matching occurrence from the second instance will be replaced till the end of the line. So in other words, except the first occurrence, all of the other matching portions will be replaced. So this pattern matches a word starting with B. So these two words should be replaced. And if you change it to 3G, so replace from the third occurrence till the end of the line. So in this case, only the third occurrence is replaced. Hope you enjoyed this tip.